My name is Ben Sigmund, and I'm an evaporation product specialist here at Buki. Today I want to talk to you about our Rotovapor R300, but first I want to show off our state-of-the-art demonstration lab. Come on in! Buki's demonstration lab here in our main office is used to showcase instruments and conduct feasibility studies on customer samples. If you've been talking to the customer about a Buki product for a few weeks, but the customer needs just a little more information, Scheduling a virtual demo connects the customer directly with a product specialist like me who can walk through instrument features, operation, and other questions that may arise. For novel applications, Buki can even coordinate a feasibility study where samples are sent to our lab by the customer so they can be tested directly on our instruments to show project viability. If the customer needs a live lab demonstration, you can connect with your Buki representative to coordinate lab time. Now let me show you our R300. This is our flagship model, which boasts all of the features that define a rotovapor, as well as some advanced features which set the R300 above other models. The basic features and functional principles of a rotary evaporator are the same. A sample is placed in an evaporating flask, the vacuum pump lowers the pressure of the system, and the advantage to vacuum distillation is that it allows for a gentler and more efficient solvent removal since the boiling point is related to pressure. Reducing the pressure lowers the boiling point. However, usually some heat is provided by a bath to speed up the distillation. A manual or electronic lip lowers the flask into the bath and rotates to increase the surface area for evaporation. When the sample boils, it becomes a vapor and is pulled toward the condenser. A chiller circulates water through the condenser to condense solvent vapor back to a liquid, collecting it below in the receiving flask. Usually this distillate is discarded and the desired product remains in the evaporating flask. Where things become advanced and automated is with a controller. All of the main components that I mentioned are fully integrated for centralized control. The controllers also have a solvent library to predict ideal vacuum conditions based on the available heating and cooling temperatures. The system can also connect to additional sensors, like the foam sensor, which automatically aerates the system when samples foam too much, or a fully automated sensor that monitors the heating, cooling, and vapor temperature while automatically adjusting the pressure to complete a distillation without user interaction. I have to go check some emails, but I'll be able to monitor the progress of my distillation directly from my phone. It's almost like being two places at once. Again, I'm Ben Sigmund with Boogie, and thank you for watching.